to ask you very politely, calmly, and nicely. To get out of bed! sunny morning it's quarter to seven and it's the first day of the season yeah let's go try and catch some fish gonna fish from the bank today and from the boat so i'm gonna whip down to the train station pick up steven i'm gonna grab the boats and i'll see you on the broads in a little while You're out yourself today on the first day of the season, out on the rivers or on the lake or something like that, whatever you're going to be doing. Good luck in your own fishing, maybe catch a few. But for us, like I say, today is the first day of the season back on the rivers. So we're on the river. <laughs> You'll see them on the broads again now for the next few months. I'll still be doing like sea fishing, lake fishing, you know, mixing it all up as well but we can go on the broads as well now, so that's awesome. Right, so we're all dieseled up, let's get on with the journey. Would you like to say you have to bear with me a bit on these sessions over the summer? We'll get hay fever, so I'm going to have a sniffly nose sore watery eyes stuff like that it's a bit of a pain but I'll do my best to keep the videos and stuff coming nicely fish hopefully. Uh, got a couple of new rods with me today and reels. Which are short, six foot, seven foot rods. So hopefully that'll make fishing out of the boat a lot easier. One's a soft rod, one's a stiff rod. They're actually going to be my perch spinning and pike spinning rods from the bank and stuff but they obviously cross over to fishing out the boat as well so fingers crossed we're going to get a few fish I'm now about to grab Stephen just down the road here at the station and we're off to pick up the boats we'll then get the boats drive about seven eight miles to our spot put them in the water and away we go Down the 
train station or as much as I know of the train station I think that's here <laughs> Train to get in, and we'll be on our way. today struggling just to get to the riverside <laughs> let's get through down here a bit I remember we've got a boat on the road for the river with the trees in it Off a car, mine sitting down there in the water. Stevens is there, they're getting pumped up. Still got to put a bit of air in mine as yet. They don't take five minutes to pump up, they're quite easy to do. Then we'll get them in the water, set up some rods, and away we go. I'm gonna need the tissues today with the old hay fever. Alright, let's go. Hello. Now? Oh, I'll start testing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, I'll put a package. Oh. I'll start testing. Look what made that spool. I'll go as far as I can get over there. Oh, okay. That's what I got out of noise, I thought. Hang on, hang on. That's why. Why? What have I done? That's right. Those two holes are open. I'm going to go out there. Is it good? Oh, Jesus. I'm like a solid solid thing. Yeah, I'm solid. Yeah. 
You can buy electric ones, please. That's just the knees. Nearly up. That's just the knees pulling the knees, that's what I got that. Oh. <laughs> that looked good, not I'm standing down and doing that, I'm not putting the straight hard work on it. Yours, we know where we are then. In the boat we've got a rod set up got a little float on and some maggots i won't talk about the rod enough today because i'm going to do a reveal on it because it's a new rod and stuff new reels so let's go see what we can catch i've already got my top off because i'm roasting right let's pour it into the river through the lilies i'm just going to go across to the other side here to start with have a couple of casts around these lilies. Just drift downwards and see if we can get a few fish like that. 
Need to keep your sunglasses on quick. Try and stop pollen blowing in my eyes. And let's see what we can do. Hopefully not too many boats will be coming down this way. Right. Literally going to drift. Spin you around. Whew. Right everyone. I'll just pop back in again because I forgot to put the old suntan lotion all over me. But I've done that now. And we're now on our way out and off to see what we can find. It's an absolutely lovely day. I'm cruising along in second gear, not even needing fourth, fifth or nothing like that. It's lovely. I'll spin you around and let you see where we're going. We'll try all different spots and hopefully we'll get a few fish. We can get to spots where you can't get to on the bank now, that's the good thing. So that gives us an advantage to other people fishing on the bank. There, we're cruising along a river. There's a lot of boats all over the place. Yeah, have a go. Steve is just ahead in his boat. We're gonna go around this corner up the top here. We're gonna have a little go in there. Just keep it in low gear so your battery lasts all day. some sunspots but we have to find some shade as well. Hopefully the picture and everything's all nice and clear for you. Should be. <laughs> well I can actually see a few fish in the lilies there. We've got the old polar woods on. We're off around here, we're gonna have a little go around this little bit of yard here. See what we can do. Oh. Looking up the stuff as we go along here. <laughs> Cheating. up the back of another boat. <laughs> I'm going to cheat and go down here and find a little shady spot. Just going, to, just going to find a little shady spot down here. I can see just a spot. <laughs> this year, I'm going to be doing that all day probably. Into here. Oh, there's fish in front of me, that's good. Right, I'll get sorted and I'll bring you back. Right, I'm spinning myself around here and I'm going to pull into the side there. Zooms into a fish, hopefully you can see that. That one. This one. There's plenty of rudding these lilies. <laughs> what? Well, I saying, oh my god. Cow gone so far, so I hope I don't fall in or that. I think she 
hold it to keep. Well, I've got a fence. Pull yourself up, don't you? At least I'm live anyway, so you can just lock up. Uh oh. Sean. The new tiddly. Fishy wishy everyone, fishy wishy. So we're finding some rod. Right. We're moving again. We keep drifting downwards, so moving around trying to find a bigger shoal I can see plenty of fish in the lilies We've just got to find some bigger ones I had a half decent rod on a minute ago be nice if I could find a tench or something like that but Definitely plenty of rod, I don't know if you can see him on the surface. Swimming around. We're looking for some bigger ones if possible. I can see a spot of water try down here. The whole river's covered in lilies and weed on the bottom. Loads of birds, I'm seeing dragonflies, you name it, I'm seeing all sorts. <laughs> oh, there's a load of fish in front of us. That's good. Try and creep in without scaring them. I'm going to spin around and sit myself under them trees there. Hey, Dan. I think we'll give
give that a go here. Should be able to see where I'm casting just down there. Just sit here on top of the lilies, see where we drift to, see if we can get a few bites. Oh, straight under, fish on. It's <laughs> a good start, one. Maggots on at the moment. And that's all I'm doing is just sort of coming down into the lilies like that. Let it go down. Oh, yeah. oh, here we go. Fish on. Fish off again. Just as I'm going to grab them. Hopefully, we're going to stay still a bit when I'm sitting on top of these lilies. If not, we'll tie ourselves up to a tree. We'll do it like that. Steven off down the end there, he's gone off down the river by the looks of it. You going down the river? Keep hooking these lilies, but that soon come off them. Let's have a go right in front of the camera, shall we? See if we can get a bite there. Yep, straight under. Good shot. I haven't bought every single one to camera, but I think I'm on around 10 now. So I'm not filming every single time I have a cast. We seem to be doing okay. This is all good. Fish on. Oh, fish off. <laughs> Crazy. I'm getting a few now. Near enough a bite of cast. Unless I get caught on a lily or something like that. Same spot at the moment. Here we go, we've got a bite. Oh, we can see some fish next to me. It's actually quite clear at the moment. Oh, fish on. Yeah, everyone, Mr. Rudd. Fish on. <laughs> Bit bad one. Definitely plenty of fish down there. There we go, Mr. Rudlet. Let's get him back. See literally thousands and thousands of fry around me. But we're still finding the bigger fish has 
got a bit perched down there, probably trying to take his fry, I would have thought. So that's what I'm trying to get. Oh, caught on a lily. <laughs> Fish on. Golden Rod. Hey. Keep hearing strikes and stuff around me. I think it's pike taking small fish. But yeah, we're getting plenty of bites. It's literally a fisher cast. We're getting covered in slime, <laughs> but they've all been rudd so far. Probably had, I don't know, another six or seven of these since I last saw you. <laughs> There's still plenty of fish coming up. Not trying, uh, yeah, trying to find a few of the big ones really, but you can only get what you get a bite off, can you? I'm looking around trying to find the perch in amongst the fry shells. Right, we're having a bit of a wonder. Had plenty of fish where we were, but nothing too big. down there in a sec. Yeah, no problem. You're fine for the day, eh? No, I'm just getting the bump out today. Yeah, oh, right, yeah. Way. Yeah. Still got some cleaning to do. Yeah. <laughs> this one's not so bad. <laughs>
should we go this time then? Don't know where Stephen's gone, if he's still on the end of here or he's gone off down the river a bit. Just trying to follow the shoals of fry and see if I can see any like two, three pound perch. Just napping at There's fry absolutely everywhere, which is a good sign. The roof is doing okay. Scaring a few fish as we go through, so there's plenty of fish about. Sounds hot on my arms. Glad I got that lotion on. Trainers, I think. I'm gonna be here for a while, so might as well be comfortable. Oh, there's a couple of good fish out in the middle there. Eh? Getting chased by pipe, they're going crazy. Where? Yeah. Oh. Nice fish, guys. But on bread, I'm getting them off. Nice. There's no boot air, is what I'm doing. You ought to cast tight over there, and um, I've been sitting there waiting for how long you're going to be. Is that chap lady time now? Huh? <laughs> chap lady time now? Funny. What? That's not a. I'm great. 
we think about it, that's a, that's a look at the boat. Can you see anyone in it? Yeah. It's empty. What? There's three people in there. Is he? Yeah. Seriously, in that boat? Yeah, right here. Yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. Oh, I thought I said, oh. Oh, well, I ain't said nothing. I've been sitting there for about an hour. Well, since I got here. I've had yeah. about, about 30 rides. Seriously, I've heard of that loads. I didn't know you've been camping, but I've had, yeah, quite a few. I've got to find a shady bit because I'll get burned too quick. I'll grab room. Yeah. You won't mind if you ask? I thought I was going to find you right down there. Yeah, I do wonder. You haven't actually put any bait in yet, have you? Yeah. Hey! My little fishy jumping at me hands there. Then a little rud. A little rud from the new spot. Had a couple of casts and already had some fish. Getting a feel of them. I think we've got another one on now. Oh, I missed that one. <laughs> Alright, everyone, we're going to try a bit of this. It's a bit of prawn. See how we get on. We're sitting here in the jungle. Oh, I'm getting tails thrown at me. There, yeah, everyone, we're fishing. The lily's just behind us here. Go. Oh, what have we caught the tree? <laughs> we didn't need to do that, did we? We've got the fish. There's any trouble I'm running this from trees there. Quite hard to cast, but because I've got a little rod, it's not too bad. It'd be nice if I could push me around a little bit more. I do need to get the old mud weight to it instead of just having rope. That'd be a lot better. See if I can get you tangled up in there a bit. And that might keep us still. I am tied to the tree, but you still drift to a certain point. Fish on. Fish there. 
Sorry about the scenery. It's <laughs> my best way of keeping you there, really. Let me see if I can spin this up right now. How's that? A bit bigger. Oh, this tree's a pain. Get off. <laughs> huh? No? Most of the lilies. Look at that. Oh, water. <laughs> Point straight away, we missed it. Yeah, we sit in the middle of the lilies. Yeah, we should be okay. Oh, here we go. Fish on. If you want any pike bait, there's hundreds of them here. <laughs> this sort of size. Oh, it went a bit that way. bottom of the boat to blow up soft bottom so it's no deal. Whew, sitting here in like 24 25 degrees now it's pretty warm. I'm in the shade. Not having my eyes much but cool. The water not bad. Oh, fish on. <laughs> oh, fish on. Oh, I missed that one. Oh, no, we got it. We got it. They're only small ones, but I did lose a, a bigger fish a little while ago, which is why I'm persisting in the same spot. I thought I had a bream on a little while ago. So we'll have a few more casts, and then we'll just keep moving around until we find a bigger shoulder fish. And then once we do, we'll, we'll start baiting that area. I'm trying to get them going. Big old bird down there. And if you can hear that. Marsh arrow or something like that, maybe. Yep, I can see it. That took something. Pull it straight away. Very sharp. Slightly bigger this one. Yeah, I don't know what that marsh arrow just took. I think it took a fish. It took something. If I didn't take a fish, I took a chick or something off the top of the water. Nothing too massive, but got a net full of them at the moment. Oh, it's all part of the fun, isn't it? Whew, till you get a pike grab one on the way in, then you're in trouble. Oh, talking about pike, something just scared a load of fish away just then.
This is so light, I could literally hold it with two fingers all day. Oh, definitely worth getting. There we go. There's a charm. Need a tiddler this time, by the looks things. Well, still bring a fish to the boat. And that's the aim of the game. Steve has moved off down the river a bit, but we still hear him. And he ain't far away. I don't know what someone's doing down there, but a lot of noise. If they're cutting grass, I'm out of here. <laughs> It'll go somewhere different. Don't need that on top of your hair fever. Hopefully you can see exactly what I'm doing here like this. Yeah, you can. Here we go. This one's putting up a bit of a fight. Ooh, a bit bigger fish, isn't it? I like it. They are there. This is what I like about this whole inside of the boat is all blow up. They can jump at your hands, they can do what they like, and they're still alright. They'll be jubbly. You know what they're doing down there? They're making the right old noise about it. We'll have a couple more casts in and we'll move a fair bit down river and see if we can find some bigger fish. Well, that would be nose. It's been a pain kill. Oh. We're just using double maggots at the moment. They both going for it. Any of them going up and down today? Yep, I do bounce this up and down a little bit. Don't worry about Boats put the fish off for a second, but here we go again. Oh, that's a bad fight. It's definitely christened the new rod and rail, anyway. Slightly bigger again, that one. What I'll do is I'll pull it now, but a minute, because I'm dropping it in the land of net. Just getting a few while we're here. I'll show you what we've got and then we'll move on. We've definitely had a good 30, 40 fish now. And that's minimum that is, I reckon. We've got 10, 15 in the net now. Shall we? Any trouble if the hooks get the old lilies? They're a pain. Hope for the best. You don't snap up. Show you just down the side of the boat, yeah. Cool, you can just bait up and I'll shoot it. 
show you how many hundreds of thousands of fry are swimming all around us. Let me grab you. Hopefully you can see them. There's literally hundreds of thousands of them. They're everywhere. means the river's doing good. So they will make it and the river really populates how it needs to. They're probably running roach, that sort of stuff. But pretty interesting seeing them all the way around the boat. The whole broads is absolutely covered in them at the moment, which is great. Unbelievable, isn't it? They're all that same sort of size, I didn't send no bigger ones or no smaller ones, they're all roughly that sort of size. They're pretty cool to see. Like I say, it means the place is doing well. Imagine how many of these are on the whole broads, hundreds of miles, millions of fish. So, still putting plenty in the net, nothing too massive, but there's still plenty coming in. I'll show you in the net in a sec, I think we've got about 12, 15 in there now. Oh, we nearly had another one. Oh, we have got another one, that's just tiny. <laughs> Smaller fish of the day. You can be many of that sort of size. <laughs> tiny weenie little rod. Weenie, weenie, weenie. More boats coming. I think we'll have a few more casts and then we'll move on to the next spot. Red and a white maggot, size 14 hook. 2BB self weighted float, just in case what I cast that in the middle. Soft tip rod, very light reel. Sit back in the chair and wait for a bite. Don't take long. Here we go. Fish on. Oh, fish off. Bit too confident then, wasn't I? <laughs> oh, lilies. Seriously. They come off, but they're just a pain. they nick your baits and then they move your float. Oh, now I'm in the tree. <laughs> it's a pain, I'm in, I'm in a funny little spot where I'm, well, I was, I was trying to get out of the shade, but I'm not so much in the shade now, I've got the sun on me. So we'll get one more fish here, I think. And then we'll move on to a new spot. Unless we start catching big green or something like that. And we'll stay in this one. Nobody can see exactly what I'm doing still. Just down here in the lilies there. There we go. We had a boy. Here we go, here we go, here we go. And under we are. Oh, hot, oh, really? It came off close in. Let's try down here, shall we? See if we can get one down here. Yep, we can. Let's boy it again. Oh, what was that? Big old wagon boy. Here we go, fish on. Whoa. See if we can count what we got in there, shall we? We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Three, six, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen.
think we've got 14 fish in there. I'll spin you around and show you, and we'll probably move to another spot. So there we go. That's what we've got in the net. The two in there, hopefully you can see them. So I think there's, I think I've counted 14. So not too bad. Right, I'm gonna get them back in. And let them go. And away they go, swimming off lovely. Side here. Obviously, out in front of me will be fine. Let's see what I can do. Well, it's another species. It's tiny, as you can see, but little perch. Oh, I don't know if you, you know, you obviously can't see that, but it's piking the swimming. They're smashing at the rudder and perch on the surface, which is making the fishing a bit hard in this swim, but we're going to keep trying. Museum boat, everyone, out on the tour. We're still getting rud where we're sitting. Fish on, everyone, fish on. No more rud. So what I'm going to do is do what I've been doing, sort of 10, 15 fish per spot. Nice. I'm finding them in the shade. This one with all the babies. Got a boat coming down too.
Ja, nein. Fish out of sight. <laughs> yeah, it's just the wind and the flow. Still keep coming, everyone. They still keep coming. Single mega, double mega, all seem to be working. A lot of boats up and down. I might go and hide off somewhere in a little while. Get away from the boat traffic because obviously the rocks are up and down. Scares the fish off for a few minutes. But then they come back on again. Wings. There you go everyone, Mr. Roach. A bit bigger fish. Look how slimy they are. They've got a good coating on them at home. Which is cool. I've got two tails on the go here. Stephen gave me another tail, so that was nice of him. I've got slime everywhere. Still bringing in plenty of fish, got a load in the net. You should. What? You should. I said you, I you I can hear you in Norwich. Right everyone, I'm getting ready for another move. I've got plenty in the net, so I'll show you the net again. And then we'll move on and see what else we can find. There you go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, another eight fish. So not too bad. The amount of time I'm spending in each swim. I've got one on the float going now as well. Look. <laughs> we'll let them ones go. We'll see what's on the float, shall we? Fish on. <laughs> there we go. Okay, so I've had another three fish here now. So that's eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven fish here. Not too bad. Let's move on to another spot and see what else lies out there for us. Join me as we move along. So, let's move. Some more fish, hopefully. Oh, that's hot out in this sun. I was obviously in a lovely shady spot there because that's very hot out here. I have noticed the shady spots seem to be producing fish. So the fish must think the same thing sometimes and go off in the shade. It's definitely where the pike are taking the the rud and the perch taking the rud near the shoal. I want to see some nice sort of lily spots and nice swims up here. Let's see what they're like, shall we? Can't really fish sort of down the middle of the river at the moment because there's a lot of boats up and down.
can see a lovely spot. It's just a case of working out where I can sit to fish it. If I want to be in the shade. I haven't really got a choice. Does that make me ill? If I sit there in the sun all day, I'll have sunstroke tomorrow and it'll be rough as anything. see to my left here there's a lovely lily patch I'm gonna do what I think is best and go straight over the top of it and hopefully that will keep me in there and I've had a fishy edge of it a bit further along the river there I'm hoping I'll get stuck in these lilies somewhere here and we can fish the lilies in front of you Oh yeah, look at this, lovely spot, nice and cool, can see some people in the boatyard on the opposite there, fishing from the wall, or oh, from the bank, you know, let's see if we can get a few fish down the side of these lilies, what have we got, yep, bite straight away, that's good news, oh, missed that one, that means there's some fish here though, which is cool, if you can see what I'm up to, bringing the float in just in front of us, in front of these lilies there. Just trying to do it so the camera can see everything that's going on. And then I'm sort of watching the float through the camera, really. <laughs> Fish around me, I can see brothers millions and millions of fry again, like there was in the other swim. I'm going to recast it because I think a lot of the time they take it on the drop. So we we'll go a bit further out there, shall we? A lot of these spots, uh, spots would be good to put a lure for a side of, to be honest. So you can get, get some perch or pike. The fish are actually closer to the boat. Let's go back down there again. See what happened this time. coming up behind me on the other side of the boat. We'll have to try that in a sec. Could be the white maggots. They want red. Yeah, 
definitely not as many fish here as there was in the last spot. See Ooh, we missed that one. There was a fish there. That's a bit of fish as well. Oh. for a better fish. There you go. That one's not a better fish. <laughs> that one's a dead lad. But it's still another fish in another swim. It won me it on a second ago. If I see it flash as I think it that was a skim. in the new spot. Yeah. Oh, we lost that one. Yep, fish on. Small one. There are some big ones down there, so they're moving around. This is a shame. Still using just a red and white maggot. It's keeping me going at the moment, keeping me excited. I like seeing the float bobbing up and down. And being a little kid again. <laughs> Covered in slime. Need to sort the old nose out. 
doing so much run with the hay fever, I just itch. I took all the tablets and stuff. Oh, we got one down in front of us. How good is that? <laughs> we weren't even actually thinking that we got one there. Better saw this fish as well. Literally down in front of the boat. Oh, look at all them fry. Perch must be having a feast. The red and the white is definitely doing its job. Look at that in front of us and see if there's another one down there. It's basically because I've got no weights near the foot, um, hook, it's just going down slowly like that. Some are intercepting it on the way down, others are taking it when they hit the bottom. straight away that time. Did have a bite there. We lost the maggot. Probably gonna get a small one now because we've got a single maggot on. But a little quick go. Definitely fish here. You can see we're knocking around. Here we go. So that was taking too long to get a bite. If I ain't getting a bite, you know, it's sort of fairly quick with the maggots going. We will find a spot in a little while and then um, put some ground bait down and stuff and sit back and see if we can get some bream to come on up. But it's good fun trying out all these lilies at the moment just to see if we can find a few fish. Species. Oh, here we go. Golden rod. Bit bigger. Nice golden rod. What have we got in that now? One, two, three, four, five, six. Lovely, right. Spot. Spot. 
Ada di kuda. I'm hoping you can see exactly what I'm doing now. I don't know if you can see the float, hopefully. A lot of bubbles coming up in these lilies. Don't know what they're all about. I twitch it every now and again just in case it's sitting on a lily stem or something on the way down. You need to make sure it's presented in the right sort of spot. Fair few fish just topping. Nothing crazy big. But... All right, what I'll do is I'll have a few more casts and I'll bring you back in a little while. See what's in the net. Oh, it's boom, they're coming down the river. Help, oh, fish on. Still pulling up the fish. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine at this one. We'll put them back where they go. And we'll move on to the next spot. Where shall we go? Spin your round. Okay, there's lots of boats about. <laughs> right. Right. Made the old sandwiches. I don't know about five o'clock tomorrow. <laughs> so let's get a couple of these out. Keep us going. We'll send this one. Cheese spread. And then cheese and ham. Good mustard. That'll get us recharged for a little bit. Got the old bottle of water to keep me going. Also got a bottle of Luke's Aid to give me some energy if I need some. Cookies. 
kick next in the two other bits and pieces. So should keep us going. So I'm gonna sit here and eat this. Enjoy this little bit of the, where I'm parked up. And then I'm gonna move down the river down that way. I'm gonna find somewhere to moor up. I've had Six fish in this swim now, so doing all right. We put them back. It's a lot harder here because every time a boat comes off, it pushes me right into the bushes. So it's a bit of a pain. All right, I'm going to put these fish back. We'll move down river and let's see what else we can find. So that'll spin you around while we're moving. Sorry about the wind. Lots and lots of lovely little spots all along here, but I'm going to move down river a fair bit now and see what we can find in this end. Oh, fishy issues. That's what man looks like a lovely spot. Now, maybe later. Shame it's on the left hand side just to let this boat overtake. We're not in no rush today to be launching down the river. We've got to save our battery. We'll just use it when we need it. Definitely a nice day <laughs> Doing alright, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I've had plenty of small stuff, <laughs> over 50. <laughs> nice chap, off on his boat and do a couple of days fishing he was saying. That's cool. Loads of really nice spots along here. If I fancy stretching my legs a little bit so I might find a bank spot and never go like that for a little while. The swan and a load of babies. Another big old cruiser catching me up. Oh, it's really hot in this sun. Much better off in the shade. If you love the sun, then it's ideal, but it don't do me too good. Lots of these spots look really, really good, but I need somewhere to get into the shade to fish. Can't just sit over here scorching. 
I mean, obviously not every day I come out is going to be like this, roasting away. But. I'm going to just pull into the reeds here, this is a big old boat one. Cast here while it doesn't take long. First cast straight into a rud. Seem to be all over the place at the moment. Sometimes these shoals are not right there, perch and other stuff like that. But, but at the moment, they yeah, seem to be rud and perch is what we're getting. But nothing too huge size. And so I will go bigger baits and put some ground bait and stuff down at a different spot when I find somewhere I want to actually stop for an hour or so, a few hours. Somewhere it looks you know, like it's going to hold some bream and some bigger fish. We've got a chance of bream, tench, carp if we're really lucky. But you never can tell what you're going to get a bite off next. Whew. Definitely fishing these lilies, which is cool. Oh, here we go. Oh, I missed that one. I'm just flying along, take me into the lily. Let's have a go right down in front of the boat, shall we? It's really hot. You definitely can't sit in this sun like this. Just thought I'd have a couple of casts, but it's no good because it won't last all day like this. Oh. See if we can get one more bite here while we're here. Yep, here we go. Oh! We lost that one. It's definitely fish here. I'm getting scorched to sit here, that's the trouble. We'll see if I can get one more. Yep, bite again. Oh, missed it again. Bite crafty. Got this one. Oh no. <laughs> I just lost three in a row on the way in. Crazy. Keep missing them. <laughs> right, I'm going to move up there now. Bugs landing on me. The pain. So we've got some other people fishing in the boat up here.
heron. and stuff. That was spoil things. See a boat on the bank. But I know who that is. Hello. Any fish here? I'm back in a minute. 
So Diane's will serve all my fish. Mind you, sort of keep straight. That one that you've got there, I've got there, I've got to do that. <laughs> I'm trying to lean back, I can't. <laughs> oh, oh, Jesus, that was hard work. <laughs> I think right. I felt like I'd done all on my own. You should stay there now, hopefully. I just sold my own, I did. We really, we should be led you out in the middle, shouldn't we? Oh, I'm back. Yeah. Not a lovely girl. The house is the other side of this tree in the boot. I thought we were going to sit on the bank. I like being on the water. Ah. Just, I don't know, it'll feel like it's cooler. Probably isn't. <laughs> what, you're throwing bread in? That's still good, that's hard. Should have broke up and threw it, see if anything come up. This is a spot where I want to put a load of bait down, a load of ground bait and all sorts. Keep doing it for a few weeks. Mm. We'll say there's a lot of sports in there, I'll give like five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-twenty, thirty-twenty-one, thirty-twenty-two, thirty-twenty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-twenty, thirty-twenty-one, thirty-twenty-two, thirty-twenty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-twenty, thirty-twenty-one, thirty-twenty-two, thirty-twenty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-twenty, thirty-twenty-one, thirty-twenty-two, thirty-twenty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-twenty, thirty-twenty-one, thirty-twenty-two, thirty-twenty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty
Yeah, like I said, I had a really good go there, but put the bait down and everything, just couldn't get any fish going. Sometimes you just have to keep moving to find the spots. Probably see up ahead a bit, Stephen's up there. And if you look further down the river, you can see the um, maintenance boat. Don't know what he's cutting, I hope he's not doing nothing you know, where he is now. You don't really want that. All floating around the water, trying to fish. these areas look really fishy but there's no shade for me to get in. I'll obviously try them another day when it's not roasting hot I guess. There's no point in getting ill. We won't be able to fish for the rest of the weekend or you know, get any more trips on. So. I'll be going to have a quick cast into some of these lilies while we're going along. Just see if I get any bites.
right. Let's give her a go, shall we? See if we can get one first cast, shall we? That'd be cool. Right in front of the camera. Down in front of these lilies. See what's there. Oh, here we go. We have a bite. Well, it's actually fish pecking, pecking at the float by the looks of it. Yep. <laughs> oh. I don't know what else is there, it's just made all that frost. Something's digging up the bottom down there. Fancy up and down here, but that's a good spot because the wind's pushing us into the bank. Let's give it a little wiggle, let it settle again. Doing it again. It's weird, isn't it? Oh, there's heck of my float. It's not what we want, we want proper bites. Do bear with me, I'll have a few casts around see if I can find some fish. I'll bring you back. Right, everyone, bit of an update. I've got 23 in the net, all up to sort of that size, they're nothing massive. Um, Little rudd and perch. So let's add that onto the total. We must be getting quite close to 100 now. I would say another 10 fish would definitely do it. There's the old museum boat behind us. Nice. So let's keep doing it. I'll stay on for a bit, let you see a few fish coming in. Put a single red maggot on. So we'll whip it out there like that, bring it down close in. Hopefully, we'll get a bite. They did have a nice go on the old paddle ward, but... Fish on. It's only a baby. Oh, fish in the boat. Fish in the net. <laughs> we'll plonk it down for a second. I'll give you a little look at what's in the net. Try to. <laughs> you can see there's a fair few in there, I'm not going to keep them out long. Uh, what we got? There's two or three. Woo! They're wearing that sort of size. It's nothing too massive, but not teeny. We know there's 24 in there now, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to let them go. So they want them in the net. Oh, 
switch on. 25 in the swim. It's quite windy here, but I'm tied up to a tree behind me. On both ends of the boat, so we can't really drift around much. Might try a little bit of ledger in the mountain and go sort of around the middle and see if I can find something a bit bigger. We'll just get a few more of these. channel I'm going to show you little tangles and that everyone gets a tangle no need to cut it out and pretend you're a perfect angler because no one is bag in the water just down the side of the lilies show you where we're actually fishing at the minute. I'll get you out of the stand and actually show you the spot. We've got a bite. A lot of bugs man. Oh, fish on, fish off. me around but I ain't moving far. Let <laughs> me move you back to there so you can see what I'm actually doing. Oh, I didn't realise that. My back legs on my chair are gone down. So I'm sitting a bit lower on what I normally do. <laughs> it's not a problem when I'm sitting there like this. I've got stuff under there. A lot of squash in here. Should be okay. Oh, it's nice and relaxing. The feet off. Uh, my shoes off over the edge. Laying back in the chair, enjoying the sun. One way around by she's in the sun behind a tree. This boat just went past. Oh, here we go, fish on. Eight more and we should be on a hundred. Once I hit the hundred mark I'm gonna take a float off, I'm gonna put a ledger on. We're gonna see if we can find something a bit bigger. again. Let's have a cast literally right next to the boat, shall we? We need to sort this chair out anyway. Okay. Right, we're back up in the air again. Which feels a bit weird. It's a little bit high now. You can probably see me better though. 
do I want to do it? <laughs> Take my bugs. Fish on, here we go. Fish off. <laughs> Little buggers. Some of these. Not swearing. That's swearing. No. Little buggers are swearing, but. Bug is a square word. I used to tell that. Would you class bug or is it a square word? I don't know. Maybe you are. I don't know. I was just saying, oh, you little bug is a square word. Mr. Perch. Mm -hmm. One more for a hundred. I'm going to change tactics everyone, we'll take the float off. I'll probably put it back on again later on, but I'm going to have a little go on the ledger and just see if we can find some bigger fish. So it'd be nice if we can find some big roach or some green. Something like so. Oh, a nice little tiny weight to it. Use a little plant because it's a more tiny little weight for this rod, and then I'll just put a little weight in front of it. Should be a AA. Leave myself about two foot, no foot and a half. Of the length, which I need to straighten out a bit. And then we'll nick the hook off the rib bed the float on. This is a size 14 camera then. So this is where we've been fishing. And these lilies and stuff here. Turn these edges. Stephen's over there. Just getting his little lilies over the side there. We've got a nice little spot where the boats don't come through too often. So we've got a little cut. And I'm now going to have a go out there. Or down here. We'll have to see where I'll get the boats. And see if I can get something a bit bigger. Especially coming out my hands everywhere here. Doing the white paint. First one on the ledger. <laughs> really hard work because the boat's swinging back and forth, so you can't get the ledger tight. And the hold it, keep it tight. All right, everyone, we're on the move. Can't keep the ledge rod still there because the boat keeps moving around in the wind. So I'm going to go around the corner out of the wind and see if I'll work around there. And if not, I'll put the float back on.
get around this corner. Maybe right on this side. Up there, sir. Just uh, squeeze in somewhere and have a look. Okay, go, <laughs> they all look nice, don't it? <laughs> yeah. So in the evenings, when all the boats park up, you can just yeah. plonk a thingy in the middle of the river and fish from the edge. But when there's loads of traffic. In there look quite good. As we get up there again, that's windy again, mate. Mm. We'll stay out of the wind really. We can. Just for a new spot, everyone. See if we can stay in here somewhere. Out the wind. Not sure if we can. We're already drifting.
get bear with me I'll get parked up we're in the boat yard everyone now I'm actually going to moor up on that wooden bank that you can see down there I'm going to have a little go from the bank I think stretch my legs there's lilies all in here seen a bit of food fish moving Looking pretty good. Oh, look down here. Look at that for a load of lilies. <laughs> Gotta be some fish around that one. Right, I'm gonna moor up on one of these poles down here. On the side of this bank here. I'm going to cast under them trees towards them lilies. Let's see what we get. Nice little quiet spot on the back end of a boatyard. Probably a spot that don't never get fish. Well, no. So, just come in this boat right here, everyone. Come along there, there at the main river, all the way along here. And I've got the old ledger rod sitting here at the moment on the bank. And we were fishing over there just on the edge of them lilies. Just thought I'd have a little wander from the bank and you can get to the setup while I'm out as well. The boat and all the gear. Of maggot sitting down there. Hopefully that tip's gonna bounce in a minute. Look at this lovely yard, it's absolutely full of lilies everywhere. Must be a load of rod in there somewhere. Just gotta try and find the bigger fish. Hundreds of fry down the edges. Can't see any of the bigger fish at the moment. There must be some about, surely. Just keep my legs working again. I've obviously been sat in the boat for hours now. Since about half eight this morning, that's now quarter four. Oh, there's a load of fish for looks like. The duck girls all there. There's a few fish moving around the lilies. Only small ones there. There's a few bigger ones down there. So yeah, we'll just uh, Keep moving around and see what we can do. So I guess get back to the old ledger rod and hopefully we'll get a bite. So I've moved over, I'm now in that gap in the lilies over there next to the bush where that duck is. There's a lot of weed on the bottom, if any trouble. So we'll have a couple more flakes and if nothing happened, then we're gonna have to go back on the float. A lot of the bites are coming on the drop or sort of mid water and stuff like that, not on the bottom. We're on the move again, everyone. 
Oh, that's red hot down there now. There's no way I can sit there. Just then have a flow again. Ledge is no good, there's too much weed in the bottom. Where are you going now then? Get in there, shall we? Where? That way. Yeah. I thought I was just sitting there, so I thought I was sat earlier, that's a bit of Yeah. You mean you're meant to boot that? Yeah, or alongside. Just need to get out of the sun again. Step back up a little float and we're on our way down this way. We're gonna try and find somewhere with a decent bit of shade. Get next to the coat. I need somewhere that's a bit shady. Which I'm sure I'll find. Want some lilies? fishing and do swim anyway. It's a bite cast at the moment. Nice little rod. What's golden rod down? So we don't get pulled out of the bushes by this bird. getting around.
that one. Okay. about one that time. It's definitely fish down there. I wish I could spin around slightly but I'll have to move again in a minute because the sun's coming around I'm on the wrong side of the river now really. annoying that noise that make on the side of the boat. That must scare the fish surely, I don't know. Take on to get. Oh, you probably saw that one. I lost that one. Got half a mega left this far. be a good spot. Fish on. <laughs> Crazy little fish. I was going to say slightly better fish, but there you go. <laughs> Nice. They came on then. <laughs> Did 
They must have just come in to start feeding. Fish on. There's a lot of fish down in here, but they're only this size. Wee! <laughs> Well, like having the soft bottom of the boat, that's ideal for this sort of stuff. Whew. Didn't take much to get a bite. Look, she's just casting out into the main lilies, bringing it down into the middle of them. There's plenty of boats going past us, any trouble. All the boats going past are all going in for the night now, going to have a dinner and stuff. further out on the outside of the lily see if there's anything a bit bigger out there. So hot. Hey Sean. Plenty of that sort of stuff out there. Absolutely loads. As you know we've had well over a hundred now. something a bit different. Ooh. Let's try a bit of sweet corn and see if we can tie something a bit bigger. 
if you have a single grain of corn like that. Same sort of spot. Oh, there's a bit of pain again. Done well to stay out here today, my eyes are terrible. My nose won't stop. Oh, you see. The glare when everything cooled down a bit. Shouldn't be too long now. So what I can do for a little bit, then I'll bring it back hopefully. Yeah, everyone, a bit bigger and not too bad. This swim seem to be the producing a few bigger fish at the moment. I've got quite a few here now. Obviously, I'm not putting the camera on every time I get a fish, but I'll keep updating you as much as I can. There seem to be a few down here, so I'll keep going. And if there's anything big coming, I'll let you know. Mr. Perch. It's sort of a fisher cast now, isn't it? Average is a much better size now, so I'll keep on for a second. And we'll see what we get next cast. I'm fishing two white and one red mega at the moment. Trying to get a bigger bream. Lost a skimmer a little while ago. Oop. Let's see what's there on this cast then. Nose has been the right pain. My eyes are streaming. <laughs> mm, I've been getting a bite of cast where I've been casting, but I ain't gone straight down this time. I did wrong. Let's give it a wiggle. Oh. My ears are a bit crispy. Oh, I forgot to tan them earlier. I think I've scared them off, so I'll have a couple more casts and get them going again. We'll see where we go from there. <sighs> Had about another 10 of these since I last spoke to you. Um, and I did lose a half decent bream as well, which is a shame. Not massive, but probably a couple of pound, which would have been nice. It would have been a better fish of the day, wouldn't it? But I'm still in the spot, I'm still chucking a bit of ground bait and stuff down there. Hopefully it's going to keep them feeding on the spot. So I'm pretty much on the bank in the boat and I'm fishing a set of lilies out in front of me, out into the river basically. So I'm fishing the far side of the lilies outside. We'll have a cast of you with the camera rolling. Let's see what we get this cast. 
Trouble is, every time I turn the camera on, I seem to get a smaller fish. <laughs> it's a pain. Right under and gone. Let's try again. Oh, got a bite. Where to stop? Probably chewed the baits. Mm, that is slightly moving. That could be a fish. That is a fish. <laughs> and so it could be a fish. Oh, bugger! Another decent fish. That one was a um, perch that time. But that's still another good sized fish. Starting to find a couple. Let's try three whites this time. Probably won't get a perch on that, but the bream should take it. Hopefully, anyway. <laughs> That's the plan, isn't it? So many little bugs in that hand, they're a pain. issue again. It's not helping me at all but oh. Oh, the sun's coming around the front of me now. Which means I'm gonna have to move again soon. Which is a shame really but get burnt like that. That sound made me really ill. I can't really see any other way of doing things. I'm gonna have to work away at putting an umbrella in here I think. Right. If I can land something big I'll be bringing it back to camera. Keep picking these up now. <laughs> A few roach. But don't mind. Keep them coming in. Can't remember the last cast I had where I didn't have fish, so can't complain. Switching over to like worm baits and stuff, and still getting these. <laughs> I know there's some bream down now, I just gotta try and get them. Getting lots of these now. <laughs> but we're still getting fish in literally every cast. Just trying to get through to them bigger, bigger bream and stuff out in the middle on the ledger and stuff but it's so weedy that you it's not really worth being out there so all i can do is fish around the edge of the ladies and the edge of the trees and that sort of stuff so i'm doing my best we'll see how we get up so we're moving again after some shade again Unbelievable the heat. As soon as the sun goes down, it's going to be freezing. That's the trouble with all that heat.
I know that man there, do you know him? Huh? I just moved out of a swim, I was getting a fish cast there. <laughs> hmm? I was getting a fish cast down there. Wait, what, eh? Down there. Well, I'm getting cooked. <laughs> I'll come in there, I'll just put a shovel in there. Yes, yes. Thing you do. Oh, yeah, by the way, you We're brown or red? That'd be point taking the run that.
fish from the new spot. See, Joe, just come in. Hi, right, Mr. Geeseys. So I've moved a bit further down the river. We're on my face. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Little rod. <laughs> Let's get it back. Cool, right. I've obviously put a bit of bait down there. And I'm just trying to see what we can do now. See if we can find anything a bit bigger. Put some maggots down there. Put some bread and ground bait down there. We're now starting to get a few bubbles and stuff coming up and things moving. Let's hope that we can find a few fish. Wait, get off my float. What are you doing? <laughs> Geese are eating my float for some reason. They won't go away. Give them a lad the nets, I'm scared of them. I'm getting geese. Yeah. Oh, another fish. Got him going down here now. <laughs> They're so hyper. I don't think anyone go for them. <laughs> They go crazy. Suppose they could even be last year's fry. Well, they just keep coming. Same old things. <laughs> but at least I'm catching and not blinding. Right, I'm going to have to go and bait up heavily somewhere in a minute and see if we can find a food rain before we get into the evening time. So I've just put back number 20 in this one. Still getting plenty of fish but I can see some much bigger ones moving around and knocking the lilies and chasing other fish which I think are perch, chasing fry. So I'm gonna put a worm on stick it down in front of us and see if we can get something bigger. Still getting loads and loads of these. I'm not 
Why? Yeah. Golden Rod. They're still coming in like mad. It's evening time now, starting to get a bit dull. Still, we can get this cast. Womp. Womp. So it's still quite warm, isn't it? Right, we're off to any end of the keys and stuff now. We'll have a little go on them, then we're going to go for some brim. We need to go over there, but I'm going to go to the end of the thing and just go to the toilet. In front of where that, the furthest boat's sticking out. Around that sort of area. You'll see when you, when you come around the corner, there's like a bay there, or a fish. You need to be out in the middle here. That doesn't mean that these toy bits won't fish, but they're normally in the middle there. In that bay there. Yeah. Kingfisher. Nice. It's gonna whip down to the toilet.
Right everyone, I'm just going to pop over to the toilet there. And it should be a few seconds. Do my business, wash my hands, and away we go again. Anywhere here? Yeah, just in this bay. Well, we could go and try in there. So we could go and try it back. Right on in the new spot. It's <laughs> a weird shaped fish. You can probably see. <laughs> Mr. Perch, everybody, Mr. Perch. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Mr. Perch. I need help to score you for this one. One. Sometimes they do this, there's nothing you can do. I can get, it, get it to the side, try and turn it. Yeah, see? <laughs> 
Let me get it. Wait. <laughs> Try again. Oh, God. Mr. Purge. <laughs> Crazy little fish, isn't it? Little bream, something different. <laughs> Get the hook out. Little skimmer. <laughs> Tiny little thing. But this is something different. Oh, we've got some bubbles coming up in front of us as well. Don't know that I'm down on the bottom. I might have to climb it and get the depth. Something going on there. What I might do is moor up somewhere so I know I'm going to stay still and then feed a spot in front of me. Probably the best thing to do, I think. She's got a bank right here. Oh, there's a thorn bush down there. If you don't really want. <laughs> so I'm moored up now, everyone. Just put a load of ground bait down in front of me. And, oh, straight under. Um, yeah, we're seeing if we can get the bream to come in now. It's that time of the evening where we should get a few if we're lucky. So I'm doing everything I can to give myself a chance tied to the bank behind me so I'm not going to drift anywhere just sitting here perfectly nice and comfy sunset in the background Mr. Roach everybody Mr. Ro -ro Roach Way. <laughs> back in the water good gin everybody Whoa. Gudgeon. Crazy, I put this bait down and still getting smaller fish. <laughs> Sun's going down in the background. I've got chomped up maggots, so she's going to catch much, are they? Got fish top and wide in place now. Normal fish. In the evening. Getting a few bubbles coming up, so hopefully. It's bream, but it might just be roach and rod and stuff just digging in the bottom, trying to find a bait. Cooled down a bit now, but it's certainly not cold. Pike chasing rod and roach all around the boat. It's crazy. The John. Had a few of these now in this spot. Mr. Roach. That's 
slimy, slimy, slimy. I've tried to sweep one trying to go for the bigger ones, but they don't seem to want to touch it. Red and a white. And a caster, shall we? Let's try that. Any difference down it? Sun's going down just over there now. Look a bit red today. Ouch. <laughs> skimmer, everybody. Mr. Skimmer. Let's hope they get a bit bigger. If we're on the spot, that'll be good.
through now. The old bream feeder will come in. Skimmer. Another skimmer. This one's a lot bigger. Whee! <laughs> Going crazy on me. Yeah, I had, I had four skimmers in a row in the last sort of 10 minutes or so. Bigger baits seem to be doing the job. Right. Going on here. Right. Get some bait on there and see if we can get another one. Not going to be too long now before it's dark. <laughs> 20 years younger, old, uh, older than me. Alright, let's see what happened on this cast then. See if we can get something else. Go to the Megadar, are you there? You're watching, but you're in the house. Oh, I'll try them rugs. Yeah. <laughs> well, 100% again, what? Huh? Mine's got back up to 100%. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's good. Good one. You've got in, you've been on 35 then. Oh, thanks. Now I'm 40, really. Oh, straight under, I missed that one. Oh, just noticed how red I was. <laughs> Bugs and stuff are being annoying now. 40. Yeah, another bootyard here. We're in um, Richardson's bootyard. Let me show you. Where a night fishing got stuck in the mud. <laughs> I'm not 6 cent for 16. Pete, I mean. No joke. <laughs> Oi. Pete, I'm not 65. Joe, I'm not 75. I'm glad they're all picking on you. Well, you'll say you look back now. Yeah, that's fine. That's where we are. So up there and around the corner, that's where the car is up there. Well, we could just whip straight in there. And I could bring the car around. <laughs> could wab. All the lights are on. The lights are on now, look. And they're coming on. No, I am for Oh, I'm 100% full. Yeah. yeah, I'm not lying. Got this one. It's not very big, eh? I'll fall on. Born 1981. They get tiny weeny little skimmer. <laughs> but it is a skimmer. That's five skimmers. Judging number five, everyone. <laughs> Had a few of these tonight now. <laughs> get some nice bites and just got to hit some of these bigger ones. I'll fish you a point. Have a little skimmer. 
just after the big daddies now, so come on, skimmers. Lights are coming on around the yard now. That's the one good thing about here, once, even if it gets dark, the lights come on and you can see what you're doing still in certain spots. There you go, everyone. Stephen's just bought a broom in. Lovely jubbly, they are there. Oh. Starting to get dark, everyone. All the boats are putting their lights and stuff on, the lights are coming on. We're in the boatyard. Still catching fish. Thank you.